Hello, my dear students. By looking at thumbnail, if you are wondering that how can we find A or how this A is related with A, B, B, C, C, D, or D, and if you are applying different trials and error, let me show you this finest way. You can see that B, C is perpendicular to C, D, and C, D is perpendicular to D. If I want to use this concept, let us do one thing. Can I extend this D? little bit towards this side little bit towards this side check please understand this carefully why you will able to know quickly similarly this cd is perpendicular to this both lines now now can i draw one line which is perpendicular to both lines bc and c uh, extended ed line from b check can i say this will be something like this please give me some response right I am drawing this line such that it can be perpendicular to both these given lines. It is same like as CD. So it is same as CD. Check please. Please give me some response. So if I am drawing in such a way, let us give this point as some point cell. Suppose F. So can I say this is becoming rectangle or not? If this is becoming rectangle, then can I say this opposite sides are same in nature. This is 3, 3, 4, 4 because of rectangle. Now, if you observe, our ultimate aim is to find A. To find A, let us do one thing. From this 4, can I find BE or not? Check. Right? You can observe this as right angle triangle. In this right angle triangle BFC, if I apply Pythagoras, this is right angle triangle BFC. Check please. BFE, if I say particularly. In this right angle triangle BFE, if I apply Pythagoras theorem, so from Pythagoras theorem, I can find BE. So here, your BE will be, BE square will be BF square plus FE square. Now you guys know BF is nothing but 4 and FE is 5 plus 3, 8. So this will be 4 square plus 8 square, which is 16 plus 64, which is nothing but 80. 80 is answer of B e square. We can utilize this B e to find value of our required length which is nothing but A e. How? So you can see this is also 90 degree. So here also we can apply Pythagoras theorem. So if I apply Pythagoras in right angle triangle A B e. So now this B e will become pi the hypotenuse. So B e square is equal to A B square plus A e square. Recently we got B square as 80 only. So if I substitute B square as 80, AB square is 3 square 9. This is A square. So from here I can tell that A square will be 80 minus 9 which is 71. So A will be root 71. I hope now you understood how your A is related with all these sides. Wish you all the best.